Hello everyone, Mike Rempel from Another Set of Eyes with today's Excel Bytes blog post. Today we're going to take a, a look at a feature on pivot tables in Excel called Show Report Filter Pages. And uh, so let's walk through this and I'll show you how it works. The, the main focus of it is if you have a pivot table with a filter that has multiple options within that filter and you want to be able to generate a pivot table for each one of those and not have to do it manually, especially if you have 10 or 15 or 20 items in that filter, Excel provides a great simple way to do that. So let's uh, run through this real quick. Uh, I have a table here. I'm going to click on it and I'm going to go to insert pivot table and I'm going to choose put it on a new worksheet. And once I have my worksheet here, I'm just going to drag uh, salesmen to my rows, models to my columns, uh, sales to the values, and I'm going to pick uh, re new and used and region for my filters and uh, my table has taken shape here I'm going to just highlight this go home and format it in that fashion so now I have a pivot table here and I'm just going to change the name here to all and within that I have four regions east north south and west and I can certainly go through and select uh, say just east and see that data and then change it to north for example see that print it out save it to a separate page etc or copy and paste it but again if I had uh, 10 or 15 or 20 items in this list that could be a very time-consuming process now if I click on the table and my uh, contextual tab pops up I have the option for analyze and under analyze in the pivot table group under options there is an option called show report filter pages I'm gonna go ahead and click that and a dialog box appears which shows my two filters region and new used so I can only pick one of these but once I pick one and I say okay watch down in the bottom lower corner here I say okay all of a sudden I get a tab for east, for north, for south, for west. My all still remains there, but now I have a different pivot table for each of the items that I had in my region um, on my filters. So it's a nice, simple, quick way for Excel to provide you with a separate page for each one. Now I have those separately. I can print out my whole workbook and they'll all print individually. And it saves me a whole lot of time, especially if I have a lot of items in that category. So again, it's just on the options tab, or the options uh, group um, in the analyze tab. Show report filter pages, select that. Pick the option you want that's in your filter. Go ahead and click OK and Excel will generate a separate page for each one of those items that you have in your filter. And there you have it. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for stopping by. If you'd like to see more, please feel free to go to my blog, excel-bytes.com, and I hope you subscribe. Happy excelling.